I'm Ricky Green, I'm a cardiac electrophysiologist at UC San Diego. We know that about 700,000 new pacemakers and defibrillators are implanted worldwide every year, um, and about 1.4 million leads are placed. Of course, the overwhelming majority of these device systems will work very well for those patients, but there are times when leads will need to be replaced or extracted. Um, it's estimated that about um, uh, 10,000 to 15,000 leads will need to be extracted worldwide every year. About 50% of those extractions are done for infections, but there are other indications as well, and these indications are perhaps expanding. They would include um, malfunctioning leads, extractions done in the setting of device upgrades, or extractions done when you need to place leads in a scenario of venous occlusion and the need for vascular access. And as all implanters know, we know it's easier to put leads in than it is to take those leads out. So having uh, the right setup to be able to correctly do lead extractions and safely do lead extractions is incredibly important. And what it really comes down to is the team and the tools. At UCSD, we have been championing the team approach. Uh, we have about 500 cases now where we have successfully put a team in place where we involve our cardiac electrophysiologist, cardiothoracic surgeons, cardiac anesthesiologist, um, infectious disease colleagues, the OR team where, where everyone is on the same page, involved in the case, understand what's going on, and when we get to that point, that's where we can really say that we have successfully managed to set up a lead extraction program, but also, and most importantly, this is how we can safely do the lead extractions so that every patient can benefit.